Yeah, back in the game. And the orcs look normal again. Uh, I, I don't know. I don't know. It's, it was exactly the same when I first started this level of the dwarf. So it was exactly the same when I first started the barbarian. And once I loaded the uh, save game, uh, it's gone. So uh, I don't know. I don't know. Although I didn't exactly try just... Yeah, I don't want to get into that mystery. It, it happened with the dwarf at least two times in the entire game, so I'm not going to be wasting time trying to figure out what's causing it. I can I can use the work around a couple of times in the game to just go through instead of trying to drive the permanent fix to it. Oh, this is terrible. The flash variety. This is the worst fight I've had with an orc ever. I need to drink a potion. That was bad. That was super bad. Ugh. Well, this will just lead to where we started the map. So we'll head up. A little bit of food wouldn't hurt at this point. Yeah, sword. We have to be very careful what weapons to pick and what to keep behind. Enemies will be using mainly, or I would say almost exclusively, one handed weapons. So we will not get weapons back from enemies. We'll either find to find them on the ground, and we have to assume that if we throw a weapon away, it's gone. It will never come back. Careful with our choices. Based on the dwarven playthrough, uh, I do have some idea what kind of weapons we want, and mainly. Well, I'm going to take swords. I'm going to exclude my axes mostly entirely. But the most important aspect is the a fast special attack. That's the most important one. Those you can reliably use against any opponent. The long winded that take two or three seconds to complete their they're almost exclusively totally, uh, used against single opponents, or they're totally useless. I mean, absolutely god awful useless. Because you saw, no, no enemy will give you the time to perform them. Either they'll block, or they spam you with a fast response attack. Either way, you're not getting your your special move in, so what's the point in holding on to a weapon where you can never take advantage of the strong point of the weapon? Might be preferable if things were different. But that's how it is. It doesn't really matter if the normal attack is not up to speed again, as long as the special attack is good. Optimally, we would like to have at least one weapon that is basically at the borderline of where it can we use its special attack or not, or even a uh, above that, because we would have a good normal fighting weapon that we can use without resorting to any special attacks. 
that but that that really the dwarven experience really teach me that that's totally a secondary concern and uh, strong special attacks at least on it were much 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 more effective. Barbarian seems to rely more on the regular combat abilities, so maybe it's a bit different for him. But I still think we do need to mainly rely sooner or later on some of attacks. The enemies will have thousands of hit points. That's not gonna go away with a few sword, short sword hits. You need something a bit stronger. Some special attacks might be, I mean character specific special attacks might be enough. With the uh, Amazon, or Treasure Hunter, whatever you want to call her, character specific special attack is enough to fight against most enemies with a strong weapon. But that's because it has multiple attack in a single move. We seem to have extra strikes or some kind of a extended or a large swing. But the point being, it's a single strike. So it's not going to be all that much dam more damaging. It's also not going to be good enough against any type of opponents. We need as much damage as we can possibly deliver in a one burst. Of At this point, the normal fighting is still okay, though. Sooner or later that will end, and I'll think it will happen sooner rather than later. I could be wrong. It was easy. This noise right now, then I that seems to be fairly familiar to me. Probably used by a lot of games. Return to Castle Wolfenstein at least immediately popped into mind. Maybe if you deal a lot with sounds, you would know why certain sounds are used so often. Maybe there's from some kind of a sound effect thing that's basically you're free to use in commercial products or something like that. So that explains why certain certain sounds are quite common in use in some computer games. Oh, you're nice. Yeah, 56 points of life. Um, dare I propose using a uh, full life potion? We could have used 500, but I think we'll get a full life potion before we get more life, life 500 potions. Ah, oh, shit, that's a, that's a proper enemy right there. Hopefully they'll eat each other a little bit. 
They have such wide arcing movements that it's certainly a possibility. Yeah, that's what I wanted. Hiding between each other, and I'll be there to collect the reward. I, I like that about goblins and orcs. But it also seems sort of believable. They have a brutal fighting style, and when they hurt each other, they're not exactly best best buddies. So if someone hurts them, they'll hurt them right back, no matter who they are. Set go. There it is. I didn't want to eat the cross. Disgusting bread. Mmm, -mm, tasty cheese. Full life course. I was expecting that we would have to wait at least a little bit longer before we could get one. Eight hundred. Six hundred. Oh, what a shame. Five hundred. Don't use that, it's too slow. Ah. That went fairly well. It's not too bad fighting with this, as long as you have extra stamina to at least be able to do something like 4 or 5 hits in, in a row. I haven't seen any elves in this game though. Humans and dwarves, sure, but. Man. Friend, we have been betrayed. The orcs fell on us during the night. My lord the duke, my life ebbs away. My lord the duke has been taken prisoner. Rescue him, please. He is our one and only hope. Take this key to aid your escape, and read in this parchment the final orders of my master. 
100 sword. Oh, that's 100 sword. A knight would get a lot of good equipment from this. Well, it was a uh, outpost for knights anyway, so that makes perfect sense. We got nothing. I know there's uh, something like this you can see spotting from somewhere, and that's you. That's your signal. These usually have traps. A uh, trap you have to overcome to get through. I think this is an exception in the sense that there is a trap, but it triggers after you have the rune. the Prince of Darkness began to manipulate the primordial chaos to create a new being, and how, before it could be dominated, the being came to life and became independent of its creator, and how the Lord of Chaos was between the gods. Blades, Fire, Pits probably say. But this isn't all that typical, but it can certainly go wrong really easy too. Not willing to risk loading from god knows where, just get past that. So. Mission accomplished. 